Hello people and welcome. Now if you remember from a couple of my videos, from my superbike video that I've done down at Alton Park and from Egg Run Part 1, still need to upload Part 2 and 3, you know what I'm like with stuff, I, I take my time, too much time sometimes. Uh, anyways, I won some tyres. Now I will say this, I am not sponsored by anybody. I won the tyres through Cambrian Tyres Facebook page. It was for a set of Battle Axe T31 Sports Touring Tyres, front and rear, both on. Also, the brand new chain and sprocket sets on as well, the racing kit. So, <laughs> all I can say is I am extremely happy with everything that's on there right now. But this is my little ride, um, not a review of the tyres. I'll do a review of the tyres after I've done about maybe, I don't know, about five or six hundred miles on them or so. I've just noticed that on the road. Sorry road kill. Yeah, not really the best place to start the video, but there you go. We'll, uh, yeah, it's yeah, people just don't care. Um anyways, let's uh let's be off. Wait for this car to go. We're in A mode because well, it's more fun. B mode's for round town. But as I say, I am extremely impressed with the tyres themselves. Now, I will be using them in the wet because I want to get a good, a good proper a feedback of what they are going to be like, especially if I go on like a long distance trip. So I want to see that. And these tyres apparently they're supposed to last a lot longer than like the T30 Evos, which they don't replace. They're just a, let's say, a higher grade of tyre the T31s which these are so you can still get the T30 Evos if you want I think these have got a 7% more contact patch uh, dual compound at the rear single compound at the front I think that's right so that um, they are good Fort uh, Teeth done actually um, a review of the T31s, they were using them on a proper sports touring bike, so if you want to check that video out as well, leave a link, go and have a little look, it's a good laugh, like they always are. I just hope that this road does not continue on like this, because if it does, I will be bitterly disappointed, because it, there's one section along here that is absolutely awesome, that goes under through the trees, this dual carriageway section, and I bet it is, I bet it's all been ripped up. Oh, buggery. We'll see. Anyways, uh, well, now I'll slow down anyway. I can give you more details on the tyre as well, as much as I can anyway. As I say, um, all technical details and things. Oh, oh, it's, it's, it's not, if they haven't done it. Um, I will pop the techni technical details of the tyres up on screen. about these tyres is you've got the grooves on them they've got little minute grooves as well which apparently what they do is they suck the water up and spit it out quicker that's what I did read on the on the, uh, the Bridgestone website so but as I say any proper technical details will pop up I'll have like tyre dimensions and what actually what I'll do is I will link it but I'll also put a list of all the the bikes that these tyres will fit on so if you fancy a pair why not I say I can only give you my thoughts of what they like on on this bike itself I will say this they feel so much better than the S21s that I had on 
I think though, I think to be honest with you, I think that's because I had the S20 on the front and S21 on the rear. But, I think these tyres will suit me more for this bike. Mainly because of the roads that I've got up here. Uh, the places that I go, so the wheel benefit me more to have this type of tyre on the bike why is there always a van in the way when you you've got a good corner coming up or a good Good set of corners. Don't say I don't bring you to some stunning locations. I mean, hopefully I've done some type of cinematic wizardry. Cinematic wizardry. Why? Why do I say? I don't understand why I say that. Because everybody can do it. In fact, I am going to do a video where I show you how easy it is to do cinematic footage, regardless of what camera you use. I mean, yes, I've I've got some pretty decent gear, but you can pretty much do it with anything. You could even just do it with a GoPro, which I've done in the past before anyway. So yeah, I will do a video like that at some point. Bloody hell, that looks. That looks phenomenal after the air like. But one thing I have found with these as well, like, I don't know, it's, it's a weird sensation with these tyres. You seem to get a lot more feedback from them than what any other type of tyre that I've had before in the past. So it's, um, as I say, they, they just they inspire confidence in you to 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 do more, to lean further in a corner, to I don't know, to take I wouldn't say risks. The hell's all that water? But I don't know to push push your limits. A little bit more I'm not telling people to go out and start trying to knee drag and stuff around the streets because that's just stupid because co corners on the streets just they're not they're not set up for that type of thing go on a racetrack which eventually I will do with these tires I want to get down to Alton Park I really do uh, I love that track as I say I enjoyed being down there the other day with my granddad and my dad uh, watching the super bikes it was brilliant I enjoyed making that video as well um, I'm quite pleased that a lot of people actually enjoyed it. The waterfall. But yeah, it's always nice having a, a new set of tyres on. It's like getting some new trainers. They just feel nice. Obviously it comes to a point where they start wearing away and you have to get some new ones again but hopefully I can have these for a, I don't know, seven or eight thousand miles or something possibly depending on how I ride. Right, as I say, these are the Battleaxe T31 Sports Touring tyres which Cambrian tyres with well awesome to give me some for nothing winning them basically all they wanted was a blog or a vlog like I'm doing today so hopefully it does it does them justice and uh, as I say I can't say much more than the fact that they give you a hell of a lot of feedback they're comfortable they've got a hell of a lot of grip and I'm hoping that they will last a very very long time if you've enjoyed this video please like please comment please subscribe please go and check out Cambrian Tires please check out Bridgestone's website website as well I mean I know a lot of people they have their tire preference uh, Dunlop, Pirelli, uh, Bridgestone, Mich is it Mich did Michelin do them as well yeah, well, yeah Michelin pilot is a pilot road something like that I can't remember um, 
and then they've got you've got all sorts so yeah thank you for watching and i shall catch you out on the bike again somewhere else i'll see you later Ta -ra.